Good morning everybody, how's it going today? We are having an early stream this morning because I was supposed to have a student coming over and uh, they cancelled last minute so yeah, I got my, well not my entire morning because I just have two hours but still. I got a good bunch of time. A good bunch of time? Does that work? Anyway, yeah, I got some time. So I thought I'd stream. Little uh, surprise early morning stream. And we have not been to the... The Mushroom Biome in a little while. So I thought I would come back here to work on this place. Uh, since the last time we have been here, I think... Uh, I've uh, made the the little cracks in the ground deeper, um, so I think that's what I'm gonna work on today. Again, there are a few things that I need to figure out about those. Uh, first, I need to uh, to figure out how well everywhere where they they're gonna go and make sure they all look good. Oh, that was a cloud. Um, and also there's like, f for example, for this one here, it connects with the water, so I really need to figure out how I'm gonna connect them with, with the water, because it's, uh, it's a bit of a... It, 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 it's gonna look weird, because I want to have the fog effect. And we have thing deep in chat, and also I realized I have top chat and not live chat. Uh, give me a second... Uh, okay. There we go. Uh, birds are visiting this weekend, so I have to finish cleaning the <laughs> cleaning in the next five hours. Totally okay. Take all the time you need to clean. It's important to live in a clean environment. Um, listening, but maybe not watching. That's totally fine. Totally fine. Do what you must. Oh, there's also. Something I hadn't realized would would happen. There are loads of mushroom that are falling in the crack, and I'm guessing since it's a village, there's going to be villagers that are also going to be falling in the cracks. So we're going to have to find a way to deal with that. Um, like, will they? They won't fall to their death, right? They, they won't fall if they get hurt, right? Let's test out this. This theory. Just to be sure. Because it, it would give me a very, very quick and easy solution. Uh, let's just search. Move. Move shroom. Yeah, it's going to give me a quick and easy solution. I'll just have to make them deep enough to take fall damage. And that way they will avoid them. Because it wouldn't look good like having a fog effect with just one mushroom walking on top of it. Like on top of the glass. The sugar cane really stands out. It really does. I didn't even notice. I had didn't even notice it. I need more coffee. Give me a second. Okay, I should make better words now, <laughs> off to a great start, right? Um, okay, so yeah, let's, uh, well, yeah, we need to evaluate how deep we want the fog effect to go. And also, what color do we want it to be? So right now, it's I think it's magenta and orange, or is it? Yeah, magenta. And I think there's some purple in there too. Yeah, and it's just magenta and orange. Lower than that, we won't really notice the colors. Um, so yeah, I, I, I kind of like that color. Um, I've seen someone do something kind of similar, having like a big hole in a mushroom island with some fog effect in it and it was uh, I think it was like lime green so I would prefer avoiding that color just so it doesn't look like I'm just plagiarizing 
that person's uh, work. I, I don't remember who it is, so it makes things even worse. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna avoid that. Uh, so I'm thinking that color would work well. What if what if we have? Cause yeah, the the purple-ish color does work. It, it it will work well with the sickly purple gray of the the mushroom of the mycelium. Wow, I felt like I was fully awake before I started streaming, and I am apparently not. Uh, let's try and find. Uh, no, not you. There we go. Um, just gonna replace a little patch or of the uh, the magenta with some uh, purple glass, just to see if it looks good or not. Um, minus five. Minus five. Um, here minus ten. Yeah, I'm gonna get them all like that. I think. Eh, let's just keep it safe. That should be, be uh, should be big enough. Uh, so it's gonna be purple stained glass. Replace. Magenta, magenta sting less and now as I'm doing that I'm kind of realizing why did I need to check in the inventory to pick some purple stained glass it's uh, <laughs> it makes no sense is it better if it's darker I'm gonna try and connect it like to the edge here Like that. Does that look better? Uh, yeah, I, I like it better with the purple. Okay, let's replace it all. I like it better. It, it's not as like bright, and um, I, I'm not sure where. Uh, hey, yeah, it, being brighter makes it uh, more. Um, it's, it, it just feels less uh, ominous and, and dark and scary. Is kind of what I think. So now it's, it's yeah. It doesn't look as like whimsical as it did with the, with the magenta. Yeah, that works, that works. Uh, okay. So we got that figured out. Now I need to figure out the depth of the um, of the pit here although no I won't work on that right now because I need to work on the sides first and I don't want to do that today so we're gonna do um, make one of those let me just pick which one I want I want to make one of those cracks deeper it's gonna be this one this one here it's not too big it's not too long so it's gonna be easier to uh, to dig it out so fill one one minus one minus ten and minus minus I said minus one air and yeah don't need to replace or actually, I want to make it at the same depth everywhere, so that's 57, so I'm gonna re just change it. So instead of being minus 10, just gonna go 57, perfect. That way, you can even just stand on top, or uh, well, f hover on top, and it's gonna work just as well. So 
something like that. Oops, not that big of a deal. So your parents are coming over. Oh, you said the password. I don't remember if you've used this or this. You expect me to time lapse every time I uh, you hear that song? Yeah, I think I've used it in a time lapse or two. But I I really like that one, and I for some reason kind of wanted to keep it for a time lap like for a special occasion uh, but I never did uh, but I might have used it for just one random time lapse I'm not sure which one it would have been but it's a, it's a very good time lapse song <laughs> it kind of gives me a bit of a steampunk feel it would fit for a, a time lapse for a steampunk build or like a big steampunk city or something like that. Okay, so we're running into a bit of an issue, but that's good because it allows me to uh, like f figure things out better. Uh, but yeah, at this at this point, it's not that um, it's not deep enough to make a proper fog effect and like have some distance from it. So I'm gonna have to make it a bit deeper. So instead of 57, let's go 7 blocks lower than that, so 50 and at a depth of 50, that should be good enough. Also, it, it, it might be a possibility, I'm not sure if it, all, uh, if it actually exists in the game that or if it's a, an option in the game, but it would be so cool if we could control the um, slidiness of the, 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 the of creative mode, because it, it makes it super hard to line up where you want to go. Like you have to kind of predict how much you're gonna slide, or you have to use the command at the right spot while sliding it's super annoying never really bothered me before that but now as I'm experiencing it it's uh, super annoying So yeah, you you uh, think deep. You said your parents were coming over. Do, do they live like in a different city or a different state? Well, I'm assuming they live in a different city. Or are they coming over from uh, far away? Also, now that I'm asking the question, I'm kind of realizing you might not be able to answer since you you very clearly mentioned you were cleaning. <laughs> so uh, I won't take it personal if you can't answer or if you're not going to answer quickly. <laughs> Don't worry about that at all. <laughs> Okay, six, seven hours. 
Yeah, that's pretty far. And then again, I um, the biggest move I made is I crossed a river. That, that's how far I am. It's a big river, but it's uh, that's how far I am from where I grew up. So, yeah, everything would seem far away. Hey. I'm listening to this song right now and I think it would be a good theme song for this area I think that would be pretty good very fitting <laughs> I think I might somehow use it as such uni across the country yeah th that's something that that I've uh, th th that always intrigued me or well maybe not intrigued but like I, I always found special like how far away people go to school in in the US like you're saying like across the country and e even like in, in well I'm, I'm using TV shows uh, as a reference but like we hear stories of like people moving uh, away to go to uh, to university and things like that or I, I always felt it was kind of a maybe a trope to uh, like get the story going but is it is it really like that like do people really tend to like move states to go to a different university or not to a different university but to go to university in a different state because like for me it People usually pick just the closest city and they go to uni there <laughs> or to college there. People who live like in more rural areas will go to, well, will move to other places because if there's nothing, there's nothing. Uh, but yeah, it's, uh, it always intrigued me. Like, people here won't just, hey, I'm gonna go to university in Alberta or something. There, there are that that there are some people that do that, but it's not necessarily all that common. I feel. Um, why did I do that? Um. Public university is cheaper to go in state, yeah. Yeah, because you you know you can still like, like I I went to university uh, and I was still living like with my my father, I was still living there, same house. I, I didn't have much stuff to 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 pay. It was it just made things easier? Um, I'm gonna pick those purple frogs. Financial aid to make it cheaper elsewhere. Okay, that's uh, it's interesting. Mm. 
but yeah, it, it's it's strange that it would kind of end up like that. Like it's cheaper for you to move across the country and to go very far away, <laughs> cheaper than where you are, and because it also in a way feels like where you are would also be cheaper for someone else somehow. You actually charge less per class if you grew up in the same... Oh, okay. Oh, that's interesting. Okay, yeah, basically they want to keep people... Uh, yeah, they're using the uh, public universities to keep people in the state. It makes sense. So, what if we do something like that, just to have a bit of an idea of what it's going to look like. to spend yep that is <laughs> totally true totally you take damage right like if I put a bunch of mushrooms here mm. if I pick one in no so the mushroom could be could willingly throw itself uh, we throw throw itself in the hole no questions asked just yeah, I'm gonna jump down. That's where I wanna go. Okay, that's a problem. Ah, dang it, I need to make it even deeper. Actually, you know what? I'm not gonna make it deeper. I'm gonna make it deeper, but not by digging further down. I'm just gonna dig this up. And that's gonna be... That's gonna be good enough. Come on, you! Hey, here's the... Follow the wheat. Follow the food. Come on. What are you doing? Come on. Okay, yeah, perfect. Perfect disaster averted. Excellent. thing is, the fog effect is not that great still. Ah, that's annoying. And you know what? I'm gonna get rid of them. Kill. Gonna get rid of the mushrooms, don't worry. We will bring some more. Mm. 
perfect. It's gonna be a bit easier to work without mushrooms just walking everywhere all the time. And, hmm, I'm just gonna check. It's gonna be better. It's, it won't even be better with one more. So, it... I need two more layers. Ah, dang it! Well, at least I know how deep I have to go. What if I change? Uh, so that would be height. Looking at fifty-six. I put an orange. Um, an orange layer in the middle. Fill. Uh, no, that's gonna need to be 56. Uh, 10, 56, 10. Orange stained glass. Replace. Um, Purple stained glass. It does not help at all. Dang it. Okay. Well, at least I know now. <laughs> um. So I'm. I said I'm gonna need to go two layers deeper. So that would be four blocks deeper. So it'd be forty-six. Is okay, that's the one. I'm just going to clean up everything. I press the button, stop it, you. Okay.
Okay, now we can do... We can place some frog lights again, but this time at a height of 46. You know what? I'm even gonna do them at 45. Big impactful. All right, because it needs to be air. Okay, gonna be 46. I was gonna say it's a big impactful change, but not really. Um, here. frog lights. Okay. And you know what? I'm gonna use the exact same trick. I'm actually gonna make, make it bigger than that. Make it big, bigger than 5x5. Five five. Let's make it 10 wide, or not 10, but it would be 21 wide in total. I'm just gonna put purple, uh, purple stained glass, replace air, and instead of 46, oops, gonna make it 48. That works. Hey, stop doing that. Um, so I'm just gonna increase by two each time. Should make it a bit easier to place the glass. Like that. Uh, 56, 56. Starting to look good. Okay, we got something now. Perfect. So I got the height where I need all of that, uh, where I need the um, the how do you call that? The cracks in the ground to be at. Um, so then I'm gonna be able to. Sorry about that. I'm gonna be able to uh, make them all look better. And I'm gonna be able to connect them with that one here. There's one thing I'm kind of wondering though, and it's should I make everything at the same level or should I somehow, I'm not sure how, but find a way to, uh, to um, make this one here at a different level than the the one there, then the, the the cracks, the one here and the one there, uh, the, the fog effect here, like the glass layers. Should I make them as, like at, at the same height as the ones that are gonna be inside the cracks? I do not know, and also just to help me figure things out. That's what I got it here. 60 just to see where it's gonna end uh, I'm just gonna place a few manually so it would end at this height here 
Yeah, I think it would make sense to have everything at the same height. It's kind of a... Well, first of all, it's going to make things easier to do. <laughs> and um, yeah, it would just make sense. Like it's, it's coming out from the hole and it's spreading into into the cracks, kind of like a liquid somehow. So yeah, and at that height, it it looks good. It's okay. I I I like it. Perfect. So I made this hole way 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 too deep, way too deep. But yeah, it's all right. It's not that big of a deal. Uh, so these cracks, however, are a bit too uh, too big for me to work on so I think I'm just gonna well I have an idea of how it's gonna be wait sorry I'm completely disorganized right now I'm gonna clean up that crack I can leave the bottom layer of frog lights though I can leave that layer down there, but I, uh, I will remove the glass and I'm gonna work on the, the sides of that uh, of that uh, that that crack. Uh, so it's gonna be let's say 15 so 15 by 15 and not remove anything oh there we go it's easier if you type the right thing okay so now we're gonna work on Oh, I know how I'm gonna do that. I'm still gonna keep one piece or one little layer of glass at the like the top layer. Just a little bit, just to have an idea of where it's gonna go. And I'm gonna make it like a lot. Or a lot. I'm gonna make it wider at the height and, and below and just a tiny bit above, just like that. Like it as if it was like a corrosive thing it, and it was like uh, eating away at the uh, at the sides of the, 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 the of the crack here at the stone and all of that I think it's gonna make a cool effect doing it like that spreading inside the crack and it's like digging the sides the, the digging the stone on the side
Does that look good? I like how it looks. Um, however, I'm gonna have to make things a lot uh, wider, uh, further out. The further out we go, because I'm gonna want to also like add some uh, bits of, uh, of dirt, kind of drooping down, like that. Could do it like that. Yeah, that that works well. I like that. Okay, 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 we got something. We got something now. That's perfect. So for now, I'm just gonna dig straight down under the... Uh, under the... where the, the, the glass is gonna go. But... Um, I'm eventually gonna work. Or I, well, I, I say eventually. I'm gonna work on the the sides also because it it needs to be it make it, it needs to look better than that than just a plain stone cliff like that.
it's kind of funny how bad I am at flying when I'm playing in creative because I've been playing in creative for a while like n not just with this series but in, in general I uh, I always plan everything I build in creative first and I still cannot manage to like properly stand in a place without falling or <laughs> things like that it's uh, pretty funny Yeah, that looks cool. I like how that looks. I like it. I like that. There we go. Excellent, excellent. And uh, now, how do I make these little cliffs look better. I'm not gonna do the uh, stairs and slab thing on that. It it won't work and plus there's dirt here that doesn't have slabs and stairs so it really won't work. This area here is too flat. Oops. Gonna do that. That's better. Okay. Um, so patches of gravel and the site. Uh, I'm thinking putting just some weird redstone ore vein veins, yeah, in in the walls like that, just to because like it's not like a, the kind of vein that we would naturally see in the world. So having those. Here and there could maybe look interesting. Add a bit of variation. And also just a, a bit of like uh, I don't know, like, well, the, a bit of more lore, like uh, the, the cataclysm that happened created redstone, so that's where redstone can be used, or th th that's where redstone could come from, from uh, some kind of weird experiment by uh, crazy, uh, crazy wizard. Change it to deep slate down there. Uh, I'm not gonna need that. Oh wait, I wanted to add little patches of gravel here and there. Oh no! I knew I'd mess up once. Just realized I thought like yeah I could place it just under the dirt kind of well for no clear reason but just to have a 
kind of a logic to that, but then we don't really see it all that much because it's under <laughs> the dirt, so it it's covered by the, the dirt from above. But well, when we see it from above, I should say. Anyway, yeah. Um... at all. Oh, sorry, gonna sneeze. Okay, that was not a, uh, a real sneeze. Sorry about that. That's so annoying when that happens. Sneezes that won't come out. I hate that so much. to be sure replace stone so is that gonna mess something up I don't think it will from where I am just gonna replace all the stone yeah Okay, that's good. than that. I'm gonna start breaking it off a bit. Hello Dev! How are you doing buddy? How you doing? Good to see you here this morning. I hope you had a better night and that baby realized that sleeping is really cool and really fun. Tired? Oh, <laughs> dang it. <laughs> uh, that's, that's sad. Sorry to hear that, buddy. Wait, I just need to reorganize this a bit better. I won't need that, 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 that. Nope, that I'm gonna need is here. Yeah. Sleeping all day, staying up all night, yeah, that's uh, that's the life, or something. <laughs> uh, it used to be like that too, but then the 30s hit, and I cannot stay stay up past like 
11 or something. <laughs> Uh, I'm working on the mushroom biome or the mushroom fields working on the cracks that are everywhere in this place so I'm figuring out the um, a design for that I'm starting to think I put too much redstone down here the, the idea for redstone here is it's cool I like it but we need a bit less than that. We still need some, just not as much. There we go. Yeah, so I hadn't worked on that one for a, a little while. It seemed to be the, well, not the least favorite of, of well, it, it, the, the first poll that I made asking people where they wanted me to work, um, no one voted for that one. And then the one after that, it wasn't an, a tie and I was more inspired to work on, on the ice spikes. So now I decided to come back here and work on it a tiny bit more because I can't spread my uh, attention too much. Or is, did that make sense? Uh, I, I won't. I'll try and work on everything at least a little. Okay, so we got this. I'm gonna just make sure I didn't mess anything up. Yeah, it's way too far, but that's okay. I'm just gonna do it from this corner here. 58. 56. 54 counting with Omni. I was supposed to have a class this morning and I did not. They cancelled, so I'm still gonna do stuff with numbers, of course. So, am I too deep now? So I'm gonna remove those. Um, two more. School on Saturdays. Well, I, I still give um, individual classes during, uh, well, at, during the, the, the weekday evenings and uh, during the weekends. I still do that. Because that's kind of the job that I prefer and that's what I want to keep doing um, but yeah so I still do that but uh, sadly the one I had this morning cancelled but luckily it gave me time to stream Yeah, I like I like how it looks. This one's a bit narrower. They're gonna get bigger as they get closer to the uh, the big hole out there. But yeah, from what we can see here, I like how they look. I like how it looks. It really feels like something got broken down and connected to like another weird world. Something like that. That's perfect. Um, so... Do any of my students watch my videos or streams? I seriously hope not. Uh, but pr probably not. No, I... I well, for, first of all, no one in my uh, 
my uh, I, I was gonna say real life not real life but no, no one in my uh, physical life knows about what I do here about uh, streams and videos and stuff like that uh, I, I, I don't know why I kind of like keeping things separate um, so yeah if if they do they it's just by accident <laughs> they, they, they managed to find me but no one no one reached out to me about that. Oh no, my coffee's cold now. Uh, you love the fog, thank you. I'm glad you like it. Uh, I really liked it. I, I really like that effect. It's It's so cool. I don't know who managed to, or who found that first, but yeah, it's great. <laughs> we still kind of see the, the grids on the frog lights though, and I... Yeah, it's not that big of a deal. It's not too bad. Nah. Let's not focus on that. It's okay that we see some squares, it's Minecraft. <laughs> Sorry, the hiccups. Okay. Um, should I continue working on that? Also, I'm gonna have to remove the glass here because it's not decorated past this point here, so I'm gonna remove it all. I can't really do that, so it's gonna be. Uh, I'm gonna keep the layer at uh, 60, and I'm just gonna replace those. I'm gonna switch them over. No, not repulse. Replace. That should be good. Yep, perfect. Excellent. So yeah, we got a cool design for that. I think I'm gonna add some redstone ore here and there a bit deeper. Do you feel like there's too much redstone ore? Like it's it's too dense, or should I, should I should I keep it like that, or should I remove some? You think? Not sure. Like th there should be more like everywhere, but uh, I don't know if there's too much. The purpose behind the redstone it's just to like break the uh, monotony of the <laughs> of the walls um, it, I think it looks good and it's it's kind of a, an, an ore or a, is kind of feels like some crystals or I could put amethyst also sorry I'm <laughs> I, I keep having ideas um, but yeah it, it kind of looks like some crystals sticking out or a inside the stone that keeps with the eerie and uh, otherworldly feel to it. it looks good so it, it there isn't too much it's not overloading or it not, not overloading but overloaded not too much okay thank you thank you I'm gonna try and keep that um, that ratio of, uh, of redstone but I'm thinking what other ore could work well down there? Because all the other ones are like <clears throat> real life ores. Well, except the the nether ones, but that that doesn't count. Oh, spore blossom. Uh, what about amethyst? Like 
that. And just a few blocks dotted here and there at the bottom. Would that look... Would that be too much? Does that look good with the redstone? Kinda sucks that I that I removed the, uh, the layers of glass. Because I can't see what it looked like through more glass. Though I could just add a few blocks for maybe this corner here. Just so I can get to look through it. Yeah, you don't think the purple is going to show up through the fog? That is a very good point. We'll see, we'll see. Uh, that, that, that. Hopefully it's, ju it's not too much, it's just, just a little glimpse of... Uh, of shiny. Oops. Yeah, you're right. We don't we don't see it at all. Okay. Uh what about little things if I put some here no not here here uh, Sorry about that. No, I don't really like it. No, I don't like it. Okay, so we can forget about amethysts, which kind of makes sense because it's already purple. Adding more purple won't really work all that well. Now that we got this figured out, I'm gonna make the um, yeah, I'm gonna make it wider here. I'm gonna start working on yeah, making the cracks bigger and bigger and bigger. Does not look bigger at the moment.
Um, so is the shape still good? Yeah, yeah, it, it works, it works. Make this little dent a bit deeper here. Because I don't want it to be just a smooth curve, it needs to kind of. I don't know the, the right term here, like do some kind of zigzags, kind of. Um, so, yeah, that's uh, it's gonna need to be. Wider here, in this part here. And we're gonna make. Yeah. Curve this out a bit. bit more out here.
So yeah, I'm gonna have to rework the entire the entire uh, side of the uh, the big hole here of the big crater, kind of as I expected because uh, yeah, <laughs> these these cracks here are gonna be a lot wider now, so it's gonna be. It would have been very bad if I had actually started working on that, on the crater first, and then connected with the uh, the cracks after that, or the ravines. I think would be would be a better term. Yeah, we see a bit of a difference between the one I'm, the the the, the one design I'm currently uh, gonna have, currently gonna have um, the, the design I'm actually gonna have, and what I had in in mind at first. There's a slight difference between the two. Yeah, it's uh, goes to show my prediction was kind of bad. <laughs> Like this needs to be the, to be uh, not be too wider. Here, um, hello, pig, penny pig. How are you doing today? I hope you're having a good Saturday so far. Welcome to my stream. We're working on a mushroom biome village. And we're actually just working on the uh, the landscaping around the village for the moment. But yeah, we're building some uh, stuff that I think looks pretty cool so far. I'm happy with the results that we have. So we're making a big, big, big crater. The, 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 the story or the lore behind this village is that uh, there was a, a quiet little fishing community here and suddenly a wizard decided to uh, settle down in the village and through some weird magical experiment, uh, some kind of disaster happened, and the, the, the tower of the, the village, uh, of the, the wizard, kind of exploded and made a big crater and kind of uh, linked it to another world and transformed the, the, um, the quiet little village and uh, the, the entire island where it's built into some weird otherworldly place like that with uh, weird purple grass and mushrooms everywhere of course it's not complete yet it's it's not done yet I'm uh, we're gonna make some better mushrooms a lot of those and some some weird trees and stuff like that but before we can really do any of that we really need to um, to turn this uh, this island into something uh, a, a bit better, a bit more uh, more complex and more fitting with the lore. So it has to start with some landscaping, which I'm not that good at. But I um, I used to really dislike landscaping. Now I'm I'm getting over it. I, I, it 
it, I like it now. Or I'm getting over my my initial dislike of landscaping, I should say. So yeah, that's what we're doing here. How's your Saturday going? Anything fun planned for the weekend? You know what, we're just gonna remove that mushroom. I wanted to kind of dig around it, but we're just gonna remove it. We'll make another one somewhere else. realize that transforming the stone into deep slate would reach all the way out here. That's funny. Also, just realized that this uh, crack here is gonna be a lot lower than this one here and I did all my um, not calculations but I, I checked for the fall damage for this one here and not this one here so that might be a little problematic though I could just like build something close to it and like that would justify having a little railing around it kind of to make sure that the, the kids don't fall in the crack and stuff like that and that will prevent well the villagers from falling in the crack and the uh, and the, uh, the, the mushrooms from also falling in. <laughs> so, is this wide enough? It needs to be a bit wider still.
from here at this height I'm gonna be able to do my usual trick of just using the fill command uh, so that's 46 minus one minus one okay perfect So the reason now I can, oops, why did I do that? The reason why I can now do that is because it's okay if it gets wider down at this height because that's pretty much where, yeah, it, it reaches a height of 60, the the fog effect. So it's uh, it's all right if I dig into the wall a bit more because I won't. Uh, it it will be dug out a bit since it's being carved in a bit more Yeah, yeah, that's a lot better. So now I can fill it in with the frog lights. So that would be, uh, let's see, 15. Uh, 
just going to be 46. Pearlescent frog light, replace air. There we go. That's gonna give us a better idea of the the actual width of the entire thing. Oh, forgot to remove that. Oops, uh, let's remove that. There we go. Perfect. This. Excellent, excellent. Okay, so we have a plan for the crater and for the the ravine. Um, I think I'm just gonna remove all that glass down here, I'm gonna keep it empty. Um, okay, how deep, I don't need to know how deep it goes. Just gonna do that, minus 20. From here, air. everything it's annoying that we can't well, we can select things with the arrows and shift key but we can't select oh we can with the mouse somehow it's weird um, replace uh, purple stained glass What did I do? Mm hmm. Thought I had written it correctly, but I apparently I didn't. can remove the orange so I tried layering different colors between each other and didn't really do anything <laughs> didn't make things better kind of shows a bit like on the sides but other than that you don't really see a big difference with the colors um, yeah perfect yeah I really made that hole way too deep <laughs> but now that we know how things are gonna be make things easier I'm gonna be able to do some grind work and I'm gonna try and finish one of those cracks um, but I'm gonna have to do it off camera because I'm gonna end stream now so thank you so much for joining me today I really appreciate it um, I hope you enjoyed and see ya we're not gonna read anyone today sorry but yeah bye